Sclerotherapy has been around for many years. It's used in multiple situations. Sclerotherapy can be used to treat an inner vein in the leg, such as the saphenous vein or deeper varicose veins. If we use sclerotherapy on internal veins, we have to use ultrasound guidance. The ultrasound imaging technology allows us to visualize abnormal veins in the leg and then we can direct the needle and syringe inside of the vein and deliver the drug. Sclerotherapy can also be used for surface veins such as spider veins. In this case, ultrasound is not required because we can visualize a needle entering the vein right on the skin. As far as insurance coverage for sclerotherapy, it is somewhat problematic. Sclerotherapy, because it's been around for so long and because it was primarily used for surface spider veins, it really had a cosmetic connotation. It's only with the advent of imaging technology that we can now visualize internal veins and treat them. So it's incumbent upon the physician to generate a report to the insurance company prior to foam sclerotherapy telling a story that this is a medically necessary procedure. If these veins go untreated, bad things can occur such as blood clots or ulceration. If that story is told to the insurance company and they authorize it, sometimes foam sclerotherapy will be reimbursed. The procedures that are being submitted as soon as they see the word sclerotherapy, they think cosmetic and they do deny a lot of these procedures beforehand.